passed away. Oh, no, no, come back. Please don't leave me here in this dark place. Oh, this is worse than floating in the sea. Arr, did someone mention the sea? Come, all you young sailors who follow the sea. Hey, ho, and blow the man down. <sighs> But when oh. the Red Rover gets clear of the land, hey ho, blow Please, the man down. You've been singing that song for ten years now. And if I hear just one more verse of it, I'm sure I shall explode. Ah, you're right, young lad. I was getting bored with it too, so I was. <gasps> What will we do with the rowdy sailor? What will we do with the rowdy sailor? What will we do oh, with the rowdy good sailor? Grief. Early and in so, the morning. for many more years, what will we do the bottle the sat there sailor? in the attic, with only the, the singing sailor? ship what in a bottle for company. Until one day, the attic too was cleared out. But when the Red Rover gets clear of the land, hey ho, blow the man down. And all the bottles were sent to a scientist. Unable to make neither head nor tail of it, the scientist threw away the bottle's message. <laughs> Washed and shiny again. Now this surely is a hopeful sign. Perhaps someone will finally realize I'm a champagne bottle. Oh. Don't bank on it, amigo. This guy, he just using us to bring seeds back to his own country. They worth mucho money there. Seeds? Seeds? Oh, will I never again be used to hold champagne? So the bottle found himself on the high seas once again. But when the ship docked, he was in for a surprise. Why? I can hardly believe it. After all this traveling, I've somehow ended up back in my very own hometown. Oh dear, what will happen now? Good afternoon. How do you do? Good day to you. Uh, excuse me, but what kind of bottles are you? Oh, <laughs> uh, why? Can't you tell? Champagne, of course, just like you. Yes, we're off to be refilled. No. Can it be possible? And, sure enough... <laughs> I am finally reborn to do what I was made to do, be a champagne bottle. Good day to you. How do you do? Yes. Oh, this is a happy day. I'm back on the very same shelf. In the very same shop I started my career in. But this time I'm just going to enjoy being a bottle of champagne. No more wishing my life away. No more dreaming of royal vaults and cellars. No, simply delighting in being me. So the bottle learned to appreciate just being himself. Until... One day. A bottle of your very best champagne, my good man. For today, I wish to celebrate true greatness. I don't believe it. He picked me. Oh, well done, that bottle. Good uh, luck. And whose greatness will your lordship be celebrating this week? Why, my own, of course. So, keep your eye on the sky today. You may see something few have ever seen. Finally, my time has come. I've been bought by a nobleman at last to celebrate greatness. Oh, what joy! What a crowd. I always knew it would be like this. How absolutely splendid. <laughs> Thank you all for 
are coming to witness this record-breaking flight. At 1,000 feet above the ground, I will drink to everyone's health to flight to the future! the moment I was made for. Yes! At long, long last! This is my destiny! I've done it! A thousand and fifty feet! No human person has ever flown higher! Yes! Yes! I'm bubbling over! Celebrate! To fly to the future! To all mankind! Yes! To champagne! To me! <laughs> uh, control yourself, young sir! <laughs> oh, no! Wait! Not the old bottle toss for luck routine. What if you hurt someone? That wouldn't be very lucky, would it, eh? Eh? No! Not again! Why? What did I ever do to you? Apart from try to bring you joy? Oh. Oh, whatever can that be? Look what's fallen from the sky. Just for you. Well, you are a lucky bird. Now you have your very own drinking cup, just like the pet birds in rich people's homes. <laughs> so there you have it, songbird. Do you see now why I do not sing? Oh, what a life of ups and downs I have led. From vintage champagne bottle to broken bird glass. From empty to full to empty again. From worthless to priceless and back again. Oh, full circle. Wait a minute. That photograph. It can't be. After all these years. This old lady as young Elsa all those years ago. I... I may not still hold Jonathan's message, but I made it back to her. Ha <laughs> ha! Well, well, Songbird. Maybe that's worth singing about after all. And so the bottleneck forgot all about how much money he had once been worth, or how high his shelf in the wine shop had been, realised just how important he had been in people's lives was now what made him happiest of all.